Hey guys, thanks for coming to check out today's video. So today I decided to do something a little different and start all the way from the beginning of the process with this hairstyle. So yeah, you guys, I just took my braids out. I had my hair braided down and I was wearing wigs, but I decided to go ahead and take out my braids. So this is what my hair looks like right after taking my braids out. I didn't wash my hair or anything because I do have a couple other things that I want to do with my hair. Um, so I was like, let me not wash it and let me go ahead and just do something really quick before I run out and run some errands for the day. So, um, yeah, you guys, I put a little bit of moisture into my hair. I used my Pretty Strands hair growth oil. And if you guys have been watching me for any length of time, you can see that I have had a tremendous amount of growth in the last probably six months or so. And I honestly attribute the majority of that to Pretty Strands. I use their leave-in moisturizer, um, their leave-in conditioner, and I use their hair growth oil growth oil and it has been a tremendous help to my hair it has gotten stronger it has gotten healthier it has grown like crazy so i would definitely recommend pretty strands i'll link their instagram and where you can receive their where you can purchase their products in the information bar down below so i also just went ahead and massaged that into my scalp and then i went ahead and sectioned my hair off I um, detangled it with a wide tooth comb and then I went ahead and blew it out on high heat. When I blow my hair, I tend to focus on the um, roots of my hair mostly and I do a lot less heat on the ends of my hair because I'm trying to avoid too much heat on the ends of my hair. So I really focus most of the um, blow dryer on my roots. So this blow dryer is my yellow bird blow dryer. This is the one I always use. It's by Conair. If you want to link to all the products that I use on a regular basis, my favorite products, it will be in my Amazon store, which is linked in the information bar down below. So all my favorite products from my camera that I use, my lighting equipment, my studio setup, my edge control, my favorite comb, brush, all of that you can find in my Amazon store. So definitely click that link and check it out. So yeah, I just gently detangled my hair. My hair is super, super thick, but I still try to be as gentle with it as possible because that's the only way that you're going to retain length and fight breakage. So I'm going to be quiet and let you guys just finish watching how I blow out my hair. And um, then I'll come back with the next step. Okay, you guys, so the blow drying part is done. Thank you, Lord. That was a lot to do. <laughs> so now to figure out a quick, easy style just to get through the day and run these errands. So I grabbed a bang ponytail by Vivica A. Fox called Louie. And at first I thought maybe I should apply some heat, but no, I'm not doing that. Let's go ahead and do it without any heat and without any products because I want to just do it quick and easy and show you guys realistically what I would do with my hair if I was just running out really quick. We're talking a 10 minute style with little to no products and barely no effort. On days where I'm running around behind my kids, running errands, doing chores, these are the type of styles that really, really save me. Now you can see the back of my hair, it's got a little kitchen going on but we're not gonna use heat, and actually, we're not gonna use any product today, so it's a no-go for the edge control. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> we're just going to use our bristle brush and our regular brush to go ahead and brush our hair up into a high ponytail. 
just get it up there the best you can no need to do a whole bunch of slicking and a whole bunch of excess product because like i said this is just a style that's going to last us for the day and tomorrow we're going to do something else so why gunk up your hair with all that gel all that edge control all that grease they, then you just have to turn around and wash it out and start all over again to do your next style This ponytail is brought to you by So Good Shop. Thank you so much, So Good Shop, for sending this style over. So as you can see, the ponytail and the bang are attached to each other. There are two combs inside of the ponytail. There's also a elastic band drawstring, and there are two clips on the bang area so that it can securely lay down to your front of your head. So when applying your ponytail bang piece, go ahead and stick the comb for the ponytail in the back. Stick it a little closer to your ponytail than I was doing. I was tripping you guys. <laughs> then stick the front of the ponytail comb into the front of your ponytail. Then you can readjust in case you measured it in the wrong place like I did. Go ahead and grab a bobby pin and hold down the drawstring. Otherwise, that drawstring will kind of be flapping all over the place and it will interfere with how your ponytail lays down on the back of your head. Then you're going to want to brush out your ponytail and make sure it's laying nicely. Fix it up to where you want. Make sure you spread your bang out as far as possible. Oh wait. First, make sure you clip those two clips of your bang piece down. Then you're gonna wanna spread your bang out as far as possible. Trim it up if it's too long in your face. Do a little dance because you feel like you look cute. Ow, ow, hey, uh. <laughs> Um, so yeah, you guys, as you can see, you can't really even see the back of your kitchen anymore. You didn't really have to do too much to disguise the texture of your hair. But if you want to be extra safe, then you can add a headscarf. And that's what I decided to do because I know I didn't put any product in my hair to make my hair lay down. And the two textures are very different. So just, just to disguise that, go ahead and add a little head wrap. Go ahead and twist your head wrap and then tie those ends underneath and voila there you go a perfectly done style in less than five minutes flat and you're ready to run out the door and accomplish whatever you need to get done for the day and yeah you guys so i do have another little way that you can style this um ponytail if you want you can leave it hanging down but i'm also going to show you how you can do it in a twisted bun as well thank you guys so much for watching keep on watching make sure you're subscribed make sure you're liking commenting and sharing these videos okay girl um thanks so much you guys and yeah just keep watching till the end of the video love you guys and talk to you soon bye